Hey everyone, um, today I'm gonna teach you how to do like a, I'm not really sure what I should call it, it's like sort of like a half screen sliding in effect I guess, cause it's half the screen on each side sliding in, and I think it should be on this clip, yeah it's right here, see how the screen like slides in, like from each each like edge each uh, corner uh, that's what I'm gonna be showing you how to do there is tutorials on YouTube but I've watched a lot of them and they're so they're so confusing like there's such an easier way so just open after effects and uh, create a new composition uh, I'm just gonna call mine clip 12 1080 uh, actually yeah 1280 by 720 is the right size I guess 59.94 Duration, I'm gonna just do 21 seconds, whatever it had, and I press OK. Alright, now we need to get our clip. Um, so I'm just gonna browse through my, through my, uh, clips. I need something with a kill cam. So let's go to my Tevin uh, downloads. And let's uh, let's just take this clip. Getting yeah, slash cat whatever. Okay, now uh, just put it in your composition. Let's just size this. Uh, there we go. And next, I'm not going to do a color correction uh, right now. Oh yeah, and I'll show you how to add black bars while I'm at it. Um, people will go like in Photoshop and they'll like uh, make black bars, but there's there's an easier way for that too. Just press Control Y, you'll get a black solid, and then go to this this uh, rectangle tool, and just drag over like that. That's the average black bar size, I would say. I don't want them too big. So once you got that, just press inverted. You got your black bars done. No Photoshop. <laughs> Uh, okay, so now for the slide in effect. Oops. Um, so let's import this again. Well, actually, let's find where the cam is. Oh, yeah, right here. Let's just do here for instance. Change the composition settings. Right, so right here we'll start it. And it will start gliding in like that. Alright, um, there's two ways that we can do this. We can have it so this one is splitting, or we can have it so the, the this one is coming in. So, uh, we'll, we'll do it both ways. I'll show you how to do it both. So, add an effect called CC Jaws. So let's just search it. CC Jaws. Put it on the clip that you want to like uh, depart. You know what I mean? Uh, okay. Now put the direction to 45. Okay, and then go into Effects, CC Jaws, and then go to Completion. Go to the end and around the end, and I'm gonna put it to 100. Oops, I didn't mean to say it. Uh, there's one more thing I forgot to do too, is size this. Alright, that's good enough, whatever. Okay, so then, uh, let's set, set the mark here. And we'll do a quick RAM preview. Oh, yeah, I, actually, I forgot to do something. Uh, so in your CC Jaws, you want to put the height to zero. So it'll just be like this. It won't have, like, the actual Jaws like that. Uh, so yeah, put the height to zero. And let's just ramp review this now. So see how it, like, split like that? That's what we just did. Um, okay, so now we'll do the other way of doing it. CC Jones on the other clip though. 
And make sure this clip is above the other clip, too, by the way. Alright, now go to the start of where you want it to be. Put the completion to 100. Keyframe that, of course. And go to the end of where you want it. And put the completion to 0. Alright, now let's run preview that. Oops, I forgot to I forgot to change all the settings. So make sure you change the settings. 45 for the uh, direction and put the height to zero. There we go. That's how you do it, the easy way. And another cool thing you can do with this is if you have like a bass intervention sound, which I do, I'll put the description for the download in the I mean wait. What? I'll put the uh, download in the description. Oh my god. <laughs> Anyways. Mine's called Intervention Drop. I guess I'd have to move this out. Intervention. Oops. Intervention Drop. Alright. Now we'll just go into your composition or your project sorry and put it in there and find like, around where where you had the uh, basically the um what's it called what should I call it whatever whatever it doesn't matter it doesn't matter all right and then put the end of the drop but my mine's you can't really hear it here Put the end of the drop to where it is. Now type on your effects backwards audio and then backwards. So intervention drop. Did that wrong, but whatever. All right. Now if we ramp preview. Oops. Yeah. And we'll make sort of like a sucking in effect. It's really cool. Uh, so yeah, I guess that concludes the tutorial of how to do the uh, screen, like screen half screen slide in effect. I guess. Uh, so yeah, I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the tutorial, and make sure you to subscribe and like. Peace.